Beneath the waves, a high-tech wonder emerges. China has pulled off an engineering feat that leaves even Japan speechless, constructing full-fledged power stations under the sea. This underwater energy oasis illuminates the lengths China will go to power its future. But how was China able to plunge so deep into uncharted waters and electrify the ocean floor? The voyage into their underwater energy labs reveals cutting-edge innovation at new depths. In our modern world, Electricity is an essential part of our daily lives, crucial for our productivity and well-being. When the power goes out, it can disrupt our routines and create various challenges. To guarantee a reliable power supply, we've explored different ways of generating electricity. You might assume that China relies solely on conventional methods like wind and firepower, but that's not the case. China has embraced innovative energy solutions, and one of the most remarkable projects is the creation of power stations under the sea, a true engineering marvel. This accomplishment has even impressed Japanese experts, who are known for their own technological advancements. But how exactly do you construct a power station beneath the ocean? And what advantages does this method offer compared to traditional power generation techniques? Electricity is the lifeblood of our society, and China, being the world's largest developing country, has an enormous appetite for various energy sources. With its vast land area and a massive population, the demand for power resources is unparalleled. To ensure continued and rapid progress, China must confront the energy challenge head-on all while safeguarding the environment. To achieve this, China has made significant progress in renewable energy, particularly in wind and hydropower. But recently, they've taken an even more audacious step in the energy sector, closely aligned with their industrial and infrastructure growth. The initiative to build power stations beneath the sea is just one example of China's relentless pursuit of sustainable, diverse, and alternative energy sources. This groundbreaking venture is a part of China's journey towards a greener and more sustainable future, setting new standards for the rest of the world to embrace. China has made substantial progress in the realm of green power generation, which includes hydro and photo voltaic power stations. However, their most recent endeavor, constructing power stations beneath the sea, has not only captured global attention, but also left foreign experts in disbelief. This novel technology holds the potential to fulfill the energy requirements of coastal areas in China and is gaining recognition worldwide. Let's delve into how these sea-based power stations operate. At the heart of this innovation lies the ebb and flow of seawater, a dance orchestrated by the gravitational pull of our celestial neighbor, the moon. The moon exerts a gravitational force on Earth's seas, causing seawater to react in a fascinating manner. The side of the Earth facing the moon experiences a more potent gravitational pull, leading to seawater expanding outward. On the opposite side, which faces away from the moon, there's a weaker gravitational force, but a stronger centrifugal force, prompting seawater to expand in that direction. These phenomena give rise to what we call high and low tides. During high tides, seawater accumulates in specific areas, resulting in a decrease in water levels in other regions, known as low tides. It's this natural ebb and flow of the tides that generates energy, and this energy is harnessed to generate electricity. The brilliance of tidal power generation lies in its eco-friendly nature, as it doesn't contribute significantly to pollution or harm to the environment. China's advancements in this field represent a substantial stride towards sustainable energy generation, offering a cleaner and more efficient approach to meet our ever-growing energy demands. Tidal power generation, like coal thermal power generation, is known for its exceptional stability and providing a consistent power supply throughout various time periods. The utilization of tidal energy to generate electricity is not a recent innovation. It's been successfully employed in numerous countries around the world. Western scientists recognized the potential of this renewable energy source long ago and achieved significant research outcomes. France, for instance, established the La Rance Tidal Power Station, while South Korea and Asia also constructed its tidal power station. Although China initially started later in this field, in recent years, it's shown a strong commitment to tidal energy research, translating it into practical results. China's progress in this domain is exemplified by the Zhangzhou Tidal Experimental Power Station, which became the largest tidal power station in Asia and the third largest globally. This station boasts an impressive installed capacity of 3,900 kilowatts and took around 13 years to build. Over the course of more than three decades, it's generated 7.2 million kilowatt hours of power annually. Not only has it addressed electricity needs in the region, 
but it also has brought substantial economic benefits to the local community. After the completion of the Zhangzhou Tidal Power Station, approximately 5,600 acres of farmland were added to the area. Local residents have been able to cultivate rice and other crops on this land, yielding an annual income exceeding 10 million yuan. Furthermore, some residents have engaged in aquaculture in the reservoir area, contributing to an annual output value surpassing 15 million yuan. Now, China has taken tidal power technology to the next level by building power stations on the seabed. This undersea power station operates on the same principle as tidal power generation, harnessing the rise and fall of seawater to generate clean and sustainable electricity. This remarkable advancement underscores China's dedication to innovative energy solutions and its positive impact on local communities and economies. Tidal power generation offers remarkable stability related to coal thermal power generation, providing a continuous supply of electricity. The process revolves around capturing the kinetic energy generated by the rise and fall of seawater during high tides, propelling turbines to generate electricity. What sets China's undersea power stations apart is their exceptional location, nestled two kilometers beneath the seabed. This innovative approach eliminates the need to occupy busy shipping lanes, a common challenge with traditional tidal power stations that often deploy floating devices on the sea's surface. These surface devices can be less effective in areas with congested channels. China's technology enables these power stations to operate in a place inaccessible to most, except for advanced deep-sea research submarines. Consequently, it doesn't interfere with human navigation of the sea. This pioneering concept not only expands the tidal power generation industry, but also taps into the virtually inexhaustible renewable energy source of tidal power. China's dedication to tidal power technology has not gone unnoticed. Initially, Western countries were skeptical about China's China's ability to generate significant power using seabed power stations, doubting their safety and efficiency. However, the results have exceeded their expectations. China's tidal power stations not only operate successfully, but also produce ample electricity. The construction of power stations beneath the seabed offers numerous advantages. They don't require land area, making them impervious to typhoons and various natural disasters. Moreover, they're environmentally friendly and non-polluting, consuming no resources. This approach maximizes the utilization of natural laws and underscores China's robust infrastructure positioning it at the forefront of global advancements in power generation. This progress has aroused the interest of countries like Japan, which faces seismic challenges and resource limitations. Witnessing China lead the way in multiple power generation fields has left other nations in awe. Notably, only three countries worldwide have mastered the use of tidal energy to build power stations, further demonstrating China's commitment to technological innovation. Chinese scientists persistently strive to enhance tidal power generation equipment, emphasizing simplicity, cost reduction, and widespread deployment of the seabed. These innovations promise substantial power generation capabilities. However, it's worth noting that the expenses associated with tidal power plants, encompassing construction and maintenance, can be relatively high due to marine organisms accumulating on the water turbines, affecting their efficiency. Despite these challenges, ongoing advancements in science and technology are expected to overcome the limitations of tidal power stations. While tidal power may not become the dominant energy source for many countries, it presents a a promising option for island nations seeking reliable power generation methods. Thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel for more captivating content. See you next time!